okay I'm back here now today because I'm going to do more work on this I'm not I've not left this space I <laughs> haven't been here for all that time whatever it takes me to put this up I've been battling away here with these I have to do a few of these videos today because I'm working in here tomorrow cleaning up this tidying up so supposedly so I'm doing hopefully by the time you see this I might have some of it done I can't actually do any of it myself so that's not good is it anyway yeah, that looks good goes around there nice sitting okay that's brilliant okay now so we come along here with this I should know how when I'm going to turn this off that will be when it's 22 okay hubby's still moving around out there so thank goodness he's all right <laughs> but if you've seen the last video you would know that he was bitten by something and didn't know what it was but he seems to be okay it was a while back now so but some of them things you know when you get a bite it just itches and itches forever doesn't it, it doesn't sort of people say there's lots of things in australia that can get you but only if you go near him you probably trod on a spider or something or an ant well, them ants bite really bad don't they they do cat does too i'm not <laughs> my cat i'm not talking to me cat he's hurt me i'm not happy with him but then again, he doesn't. Well, I was. He wanted me to brush his hair. I'd only done a bit of it because he gets up on the on me table out there in front of me, where I do me me crafting if I'm in the lounge room. And well, there's not much room there, but I do, do a bit. And he wanted me to do his hair, so I started brushing his hair. Next thing you know, he took a big piece out of my arm. I screamed and swore and. Jeremy grabbed him and put him on the ground. He didn't scream as well though. But he said today he was walking he was coming down the hall, he could feel something on his leg and he thought it might have been a fly and he kicked his leg out and kicked the cat. <laughs> Poor cat was so angry and he's Jeremy trying to <laughs> apologize to him and the cat's foofing at him. <laughs> oh dear. Do you think it's been going straight? Some things go bad for a while, don't they, sometimes? And, oh, well, it's all good. It can be fixed. It all can be fixed. If you start talking to us later, he will. He'll get over his mood. These things just police, because of the stuff that it is, I suppose, it's doing a bit of a... It's okay. When I sew it, it'll be fine. Okay, so now I'm going to put in that. I don't think I'll put that through there. It's, bit, it's too close to the colour, but I... I don't know. <laughs> I want to put something in this. This isn't it leads something to be in there, doesn't it? Something blue or uh, maybe a maybe some sort of a thing. I've got an owl there. Maybe some sort of a a little a little business. Is a heart. I don't know if I've got a heart on here. I've got a butterfly. I've got an owl. The heart looks good, but it would have been better if it's a different colour, wouldn't it? Okay. Well, I probably could do that. What's this? Oh, this might be a leaf. It is. It is a leaf. Actually, I was going to make another one of those flowers, wasn't I? I'm going to do that. Where's them colours I got the other day? Tucked it under here. Come on. Right. These are pretty. These are really pretty. I'm going to have to do something about this. I don't like the. It's just sitting there in the middle of nowhere, you know? I just feel like they're. Pinky one. No. White? How about a white one? I wonder if you've got enough of them. Because this was just a, a mixed bundle that I've got. 
I've got to do something with this. It's just not, it's not helping me one bit whatsoever. And tell me something else is up there moving behind me. Now get it. Don't do it. Please don't fall. <laughs> Mouthful of water. Alright. It's sort of balking me really seriously. Look at the teapots. Aren't they gorgeous? What have we got in here? Oh, cotton wrap. Well, these are the sewing ones, aren't they? This doesn't mean you can't put one of them on there. These are really nice. Oh. Sorry about this. People are scratching around in here like a big mouse. That's a peg. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, that is really cool. I do like that. I'm sure I'd have to buy another lot so I can get another one. That's a knitting. No, I don't need a knitting. Not on this one. It's a tape measure. I really don't know what sort of thing the lady would like. They're a good pair of scissors. They are. Another box with bits in. Well, I've got more than one, but. <sighs> These little hearts. I really don't know exactly what I want. I really don't. Maybe I'll make another one of these. And I know then what I'm going to have to do to get it to go together properly. I don't know. How many do I need? Two, four, six, eight. I don't know. Got them. I went all around the place to come back to that, didn't I? But that's how things go, I guess, isn't it? Right now, I'll we'll put this on. Yeah. So Ken Assist opens again tomorrow after being shut all this time because they closed over Christmas and to have themselves a rest. And I went past there yesterday when we were going up the street and it's open on Thursday, which is the 1st of February. And... Seems a strange time from open, but anyway, I suppose they'll get plenty of customers, I imagine. I won't be going there for a while myself. I can't go out in that scooter anymore. There's a, 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 a like a, what would you call it? It's not actually a, a ramp, it's a piece of, you have to, next to the steps, to go up to the car park or go up to Big W, there's this road and it goes up in there, you know, it goes up. <laughs> Not up in there, just up there. And I was going up there yesterday and Jeremy walked up the stairs and truly I was nearly going to call to him and push me because it, um, it was getting tricky. It was getting tricky. It wasn't wanting to move it up there at all. I was not wanting to do that. She was only just making it up that because, but anyway, um, it's all right. She's going to be replaced though, and that's sad. But and I have these beautiful flower decals on the one that I've got, and you can't get them off because they're, you know, they're just there for life. And oh, it's too close, isn't it? Anyway, I'll um, I'll maybe move, move, I'll move this so it won't be. Right, tied to it, I think. I'll put it up there, see, so we've got, a, we've got a space to put the next one. Sorry for hitting you with that. that anyway, um, it did it. It got up there, and then when we were coming home, we're pretty good until we get down the the road here, and the one, the wood, uh, it's, we are actually on a bit of a hill, but you don't really notice that until you're trying to get a scooter with no power up there. It's not that nothing to do with the power, it's the motor. His motor's grinding and whining and that at me, so it wasn't good. But anyway, we made it there and back, and that's not taken around again because I'm a bit worried about it. 
because the, oh, when you when you go to stop, it doesn't. She doesn't stop until it just sort of does it all of a sudden after it should have done. If you understand, that's a bit weird, but can't explain it any better than that. And I said to Jeremy, I might exaggerate a bit. I said when I stopped there at the driveway to come around the driveway, I said you nearly know, chucked me over <laughs> the front. <laughs> Didn't really, but you know what? It was just what I said because she stopped all of a sudden and jerks your whole body and it's not good for your knees but the man reckon it was all right he, ought to, he didn't he took it down the road and turned around and come back on it and that's all he did he never took it to any of them them places he didn't do any of that sort of stuff with it but anyway it doesn't matter I hope this is going to work because it looks a bit skew whiff to me doesn't it I'm going to push it in there Oops, I keep getting caught and pushing things sideways. Right, uh, now I'll get another one there, don't I? I think. I think there'll be another one in here. And this, they're pushing one another into a... Oh, that's the same. Oh, it doesn't matter. i just seen that. Oh, dear. Well, somebody couldn't have been yelling at me because you can't see me doing it yet. <laughs> oh, dear. See, that's bad. I've made a terrible mistake on that, haven't I? Wait a minute. I'll put the middle in and then I'll fix it. I hope I can fix it. I'm going to put a pearl in that, I think. It's a bit big, that one, but it'll be right. I'll make it fill up the space. I'll have to straighten these other things out then, won't I? Usually they're pretty forgiving, but because today, you know, because the Sonia's made a big muck up of it, but I haven't, I'm haven't going to be, I'm not going to be disheartened just yet. I'll wait a while before I start to panic, okay? See, because that one's there is really loose, and I can tighten him down better, because I made it longer for the purpose of it. Oh, well, that's not good. That's really bad. What have I got here? I mustn't have pulled that through tight enough. That's okay, that's probably why they all went all wonky. Got something caught up at the back of it. Obviously. I need, needed to get hold of that too, and I didn't really. Come here, you. Now, if you find you got a loop, hook yourself around the loop and pull the loop up around there, like so and stitch it unless you want to pull it out and that's your choice I don't want to pull it out you know what I might have to because this one is not good I didn't, oh, what am I doing up here? oh dear, 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 dear Sonia I know what I was doing up there, I was trying to make this so it wouldn't be so loose I'll have to take it undone just that bit, don't get, don't get excited now or, or upset or whatever but that didn't work because I had a loop out piece of cotton look at me pulling it undone now because I'm, I'm not happy <laughs> ah dear anyway so this can be one of them videos where I say got to be one of the worst ones because I'm well, you know what it didn't work because I've already got that colour one on there okay that's my story and I'm sticking to it I looked at that and I seen the same colour and I thought ooh ah and that's what I'm not taking I'm taking it undone I'm going to switch that in a bit so it fixes and I'm going to do something else with that I have to I can't use that now because it's not good it's not nice at all what do I do with my needle you can stop throwing things just on the table so you've got to stop doing that not good. I'm gonna have to move my legs a bit now. It's time for that. Time to be moving around. Okay. Right. I put it up there. I'm just having a. <laughs> a little bit of time out there, Sonia. Now what I want to do for this is to change it up, well to fix it a bit because I'm not happy with how it looks. 
I'm going to put some beads around on, on it, okay? And that might draw all this in together a bit. Because it's, at the moment it's looking really lonely and lost and weird. Mm. We do have a little nice leaf there. We could think about a leaf. And this thing here is cool. Can't get hold of it. Okay, and there's another one of those. That's good. I might have even used them on there. Now that I've found them. Um, here's another leaf. It's, a blue. it's a bit blue. And that's okay. But we've got more in another container over there, haven't we? So we don't have to worry about that. There'll be some there somewhere. I like this. That's nice, isn't it? It's a little bit of a dangly doofly thing. That should go on here too, do you know I think it might do? I think that could go on there. And there's a butterfly. We've got one on ready. Here's a heart. Here's a heart. Okay, so that can go somewhere. I'm stitch these on really fast because I don't want to have to put them away and then try to find them again. I wonder what I'm doing. Okay. I don't know if these are too big or not. I don't think so. It's a shame, really. I've been trying to find smaller ones. Smaller little flowers. I, get, I might spend hours on there, you know, looking for stuff, and then I'll go, oh, I might have to see if I want that later. I'm going to turn it off. <laughs> and then I don't end up going back to it. I just think, well, I don't really want that, so I don't buy it. Okay, because it, it's nothing, you know, you don't want to do spur in a moment thing, that's not good. You want to, um, I like that there, I think. I don't know what I'm upside down for. Well, because I was working on that, this section here, and I had to pull that bit out. It was making me panic, it was. Alright, oh, no, let's have a look at this one. Something to do with that orange bit, but not. Uh, the leaves are... Uh, see, they look nice and shiny when they're against that. They look good. The gold one's cool. Uh, that might help a bit. I don't know. You know me, I've got to try and fiddle with something for a while before I get it done, and I can't help that. I need to make sure it's right. I don't want to do it if it's not right. I don't know if I need those leaves there or something else instead of them. There's a fairy. Would she want to be on here? Maybe she could. Anyway, so let's put some of this stuff on here anyhow. I've got my needle threaded. But I'm going to do those with ribbon. This one's here. I'm going to find a way of putting that in there so it looks like it's connected to it. Yeah, will that work? Yeah, that's okay. Looks like it's connected. And then I've got these ones here that are clear ish. That looks a bit clear ish. That hasn't got a hole in the bottom, has it? No, I don't want to think I'll use him because I won't be able to fasten him down properly. Righto. We can go away from that for a minute. I might sew these on and then come back with the ribbon. Although maybe I won't put ribbon on them because some of them might have too much... Could be too much ribbon on here because there's a bit of, bit of ribbon on it, isn't there? So let's do a bit of thread instead and get this needle if I can just get this needle I'll be right bit of thread um colour colour these are little birdies out there twiddling away I think this this nice yellow would be good and give it a little bit of interest I'll fold it in half and thread it through. <sighs> it's 
So I did buy some more decals to put on my new scooter. <laughs> well, I, might, I will one day. I won't when it's new. I'll wait until I've decided if I want to do it or not, you know. <laughs> I don't know, when people get new things, they want to... It's really cool, though, what I found. Really cool. I'll show it to you when they... When I buy them. I haven't bought them yet. When I decide I'm going to buy them. I think I will. I'm buying one particularly for Jeremy, but he doesn't know, so... I'll just give it to him for Easter. And put it on the fridge. There we go. So that's there. And you only need a couple of stitches because you don't want to keep doing it too tight, otherwise it'll stick up and get broken off or something. Right, that one. Then I want a heart over here. Or the fairy over here. Seriously need to fix this something. I'll put the fairy there. Do I got a knot in this? No. Gonna do that. That one there's already ticked kicked up there. There's still a lot of work to go on this piece. There is still a lot of work. I've only got a bit over a month to do it. I hope the lady still wants it. Doesn't matter. Well it sort of kinda of does, but you know. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna fasten down the legs too. I'll just go over here with a bit of thread, so she's not sitting up in there. You think I'll leave that there? I probably will. Probably will leave it there because it looks okay. And make sure I do this tight enough so it doesn't come undone. Okay. Oh, that's good. I've still got plenty of time yet. If I time this right, I need to do something. So I suppose I should have fastened that down too, down the bottom. But I don't know if I can get the needle through anywhere there. Nah, I can't. I can get it through there, but that won't look good. It can hang down. See, the bag will be up like that, so it can hang down. And I'll put a heart up here in this other, this other square. Diamond-shaped thingy. Wow, that hurt. Oh, dear. I can be doing stuff all the time, you know, not stab yourself, and then other times I keep doing it over and over again, which is not good, is it? The heart. Oops. Don't come unthreaded. Two stitches through there should be plenty. And it shouldn't come off. Whoops. Good. Oh dear, all that time keeps going fast, doesn't it? I don't know about other people, but it does for me. There's just not enough hours in the day to do all the things you want to do, and then if you do get a bit of a break, you're too tired <laughs> to do to do anything then. It's just not nice. Well, that cobbled up a fair bit on the back. I won't be going anywhere because I'll be ironing some stuff over the top of it so it can't get away. Not letting it get away on me. Now this here I was going to use on something else earlier but I, I didn't do any work on it. I was just finding the thread. And there's not a lot of this colour on here but that's not the sort of stuff I'm going to use anyway. I don't feel like that today. I might put a bit of this on here though. Maybe not there. No. I don't know. I'm going to try and fix this up here to me liking because it's not really my thing <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking it needs to be but I... some thread and we're going to do some beads 
we're going to put around some little beads little green ones would be really oh no the thing's green what about purple or blue blue white how about white ones and they would be under this thing here did I put them in that box jeez I'm a good girl I packed them away now I can't get them back my camera's going to take some doing I'm not going to let it beat me. I can't afford to do that. Can't let it beat me. I'll get it. I don't know why I got it right at the bottom, but anyway. I have to turn it up this way so I can see the beads. When I look at it, I'm thinking, ah, they're not in here at all, but they, there is some that will work. I think they're over here somewhere. They will work. They're a nice little size. I don't know what I did with the other packets. I thought I'd put them back in there. I got the red ones too because I thought I might use a couple of them on here somewhere. And these are sort of... Um, off-white colour sort of thing you fluff all over this I'm just randomly stitching these on here because I think it might look okay don't know yet, we'll see so I'm going to sort of bring those things there together without putting a, what's the name on, a stem. I don't think I really want a stem on it. You see that bird's having a word. He keeps repeating himself though. <laughs> he does, he keeps repeating himself. How do you reckon? You think that's working? I do. I think it's what I'm going for. And then the orange things are not so you know, over the top, something. Flowers. So I didn't really want to pull them undone. Both of them made a lot of work and I didn't want to take it undone. No way in the world I don't want to do that. You can do this, or you can put little crosses or something, little kisses or something on it, you know, by putting your, put a nice bit of thread through there. You, in your needle and just make a little little cross. And getting it all to go together sort of thing. Just an idea of... Um, Probably still looking at that, this one here is not, maybe the thing in the middle. That's what's probably wrong with that one. That piece that I've got in the middle, this here thing. I think that's going to have to go. I'm going to have to put something else in there. We'll see what happens, eh? We'll just thread this back up. Maybe not that way. Just straight through. Hope you can see what I'm doing. Oh no, sorry about this. Where am I? Let me thread back here. Poor old thing has got a few holes in it <laughs> from the needles. But I'll be alright. <laughs> Hopefully it'll grow back. My skin. Not as so. 
And you notice I've, if you've been doing it for a while, things start to get bit, um, mm, like that. I'm just, I can't put any more in there now because I've got not enough thread. But I might put, add some more later, I don't know yet. Now that come through there so I can push it back through that one and pull it so it's knotted there and I'm not going to go anywhere. And I hate these dangly bits. I'm just going to shake this now. Should probably made a big difference, didn't it? This here. So we will taking that middle thing off too, I reckon. And get that that off there. Put a better, better bead. We'll use a better bead than that. Don't know which one's going to be, but we don't want that one in there. Okay. It's too, too something. Didn't like it at all. Got to get the cotton off there. Maybe really panic, I'm trying to <laughs> try to get it. I don't want to lose my needle because I want to thread it again now. Come on. If it didn't want it to come off, it would probably fall off. But because I want it to come off, it's been a ridiculous, isn't it? Come on. And I'm not, I haven't bought it from anywhere else. That piece of thread so nothing else will fall off as far as I can see. Right, uh, just had to fix the my leg. Come on. I get this off here. Why oh, geez I will, I got it. Right, now put that back in there. Looks like that needs cleaning some cotton so I don't lose the needle even that there, even them ones I don't think they're right either it's not giving it a bit of go is it, it's not they're not helping it at all so let's see what we're going to do with that I don't know yet, we'll figure it out though is that being put on after? they have been, yes they're coming off too. Yeah, it's not what I like. I'm afraid. Probably end up putting them back on, but you know what? Not today. Okay. It's not what I'm feeling like today. Sort of mood that you're in, you know. It does affect your work. <laughs> okay, doggy, that's off. There goes that bead. One more bit. Where's it? Here. I'll stick, cut that off down close to, to it. Careful. Oh no, it just pulled out. That's good. Right, now we need to put beads in those two places make it look good. What do you think? How about... I'll we'll do a bit of trial and error here. I'm going to have to... Oh, you're kidding me. Did I lose my thread? Oh, I pulled it out of the... <laughs> I pulled it out of the needle. It's okay. We can thread it again as long as the needle hasn't gone. Because that would be an issue, wouldn't it? The needle, The needle's still here. The threads here. I'll put it back through. Hopefully. Right. It'll stay there this time. Don't come with me. I'm just going to get a drink of water. Now I have a box here with different coloured beads in it. So I'm just going to test a few of these. And I nearly landed them on myself. I've got two of those. Look at this. There's more in here. There we go. Put those in. Now, what have we got? Pink ones or the green ones? No. Pink one? No. Green one? Uh -huh. Okay. It's not bad. Blue? Blue one? What about, what about many colours? That's an idea. Look at that. Righto. 
That's what we're going to do. We're going to put colours in there, aren't we? Oh dear, I keep hitting you, so I'm sorry. <laughs> oh dear. Sorry about this bad video today that I've made, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to be getting things done and you know that more hurry less speed, you know, that happens to us, doesn't it? Wait a minute, more beads wandering around on here. There's another one, another one. Okay, so let's put these in the middle. And we're going to have one, two, three, four. See if there's enough. To put in the middle in a circly thing. We do five. Another green one. Go down in the back. Of course, this would be be a piece that's sitting through still. Right oh, now we've got five beads in the middle. So what I need to do is go back up through, which I should have done this instead of stopping. I should have went back through the the bead. I've made a mistake. I do hope that I can solve this problem. <laughs> I do hope I can solve this problem. You see what I'm doing? I know. I need to have this joined together in a round, don't I? Around. Are they in a round? Yes, they are. That's good. I'm going to fasten that down. Okay. So nobody said that we couldn't have different coloured beds in the middle, did they? You know, that's just how it is. It's got, they look good, all the different colours. you got to put, you got to um, sometimes do some sort of experimentation, don't you, with things? Now, I need to put one in the middle. Do you think it's going to work? Do you think one will go down in there? We've got this purpley one. Come on. It'll fix, won't it? Come on. You can do this. Uh, maybe not. Come on, get in there. It looks good, but it's not going to work. Because it won't go down in there. They're too tightly pushed together, I think. We'll give it another go. We won't give up yet. Even if it does sit up a bit like that, that's still all right, isn't it? Look. That looks really good. I do like the idea of that. It was very dull before. Hopefully, we're going to fasten them down there so they're not going anywhere. Right. Now, grab a few more, because I put all those on there, didn't I? And put, in the milk, and put it in this other one here. In here, you need a few more to go in this one. I'm only going to put three in here. I think three will work. And we'll have whatever we pick up oh, blue, pink, and white. No, that's not right. <laughs> not going to have whatever we pick up, but all that was wrong. We got a yellowy colour or something. Got blue, pink, no, orange. Orange. It's fluffing this because this was all all fell out on the floor. You had to pick it up with a what have I got? An orange one, a green one, and a purple one. Yeah, that look. I'll see, eh? They were all in different they were in their own places, them beads, and I dropped them. I think it was me. Only me in here, mostly. I did go around in the circle and try to fasten them all together so they'd be. I could have sewed on one at a time, that might have made it a bit easier, but. Why would something do that? Ow. 
found my finger. Why would I make it easier for myself, you know? Don't you think that looks much better than what I had? Often there's something on a piece of work and I can't look at it. <laughs> so I have to fix it. Now that looks really good. I did not like that part at all. I did not like it at all. This here's probably going to be moved over a bit. I might have to might have to dob a few more beads on there. Now give me a second because I've got another little while to go because that's going to come that's going to be finished. The time will be up and I'll have to be off here. I might try and just put a couple more little beads. What have I done with that pot? There it is. Over here just to make it more so I'll go up here behind and through one of these beads okay if I can get over here far enough right now now I'll go through that bead because there's a gap here that I'm not liking so I'm going to put my pink one and a green one no a purpley one maybe no this one will do just need two there I think to fix that posy up to make that more so it's full up with with beads and not yeah that's better and there's no big gaps in things I know. now I've got to come up through here go down through there and that much that's much better isn't it do you think so I do definitely Definitely think that's much better. Only one thing wrong, there's only one bead on top, which put a bead on top. Oh, what I got here? What's that one? It's not the same lot, is it? I just might put another one here on top of this. With that first purple one. It's really dark, this one. Love him because it's, I need it to be level and not uneven. I don't want it uneven. I like it. Right, the decision has been made. I do like that. Now you want to pull that through as tight as you can without breaking it. Okay. And I guess it, it's something that you learn over time. Look what I've done to my needle. Goodness me. If it still come back with me, <laughs> go over there. Right. Now, let me have a quick look at this. Right here. So we did a bit on it today and yesterday, whenever I put it up. And I do like how I finished that there. And even if I've got to stick some more beads in, because I think I want to put more here, I'll do that later. Thank you everybody for watching, and you can't see it all, but it will go up higher. There you go. I hope you're enjoying this. I'll fix that butterfly and put more on him. I've got lots more to do, so thank you for watching. I'll talk to you later. Please leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you would like to see more of my stuff. Click on the little bell icon. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.